Okay, starting with symbols. So, um, I mean, what, what you see here, the, the, the little flagship, it's, it's, I mean, the, 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 the symbols in itself, they, they may be different each time, but there are some, uh, there's some core that pretty much always, mm, most of the time, stays the same. So there's, a, a, say, be beginning from, from the outside here, to put some order to that, that that's kind of a, a, a pretty recent addition. Um, which is uh, the, the Sabian XS Fast Stack. So it, it comes as a combination of a 16 inch um, China and, uh, and the bottom part of a, of a 13 inch hi-hat. You can, you can really stack it in like a couple of different ways. I mostly use it like that, although it's intended to be the other way around, but, but I just dig that sound so much. Using it as a, as a closed hi-hat, more or less closed with more or less crash mm -hmm. to it. Um, you then can change the tension here, or you you, you can you can change Aha. it like like under. here under okay. So so for instance, you have more. So it, you you may also wanna wanna use the the hi hat as mm -hmm. some say option for your standard hi hat if if you just wanna have it. Bit louder. You may also want to use the china in itself as a china, mm -hmm. which is a, a great symbol, by the way. Um, and uh, and plus in, in the XX uh, in the in the XS range of, um, of of symbols with Sabian, it's quite affordable. So it's not like super expensive and, and mm -hmm. some very interesting sound. I totally dig that. Mm -hmm. um, here, uh, I mean, these two guys and uh, and ashtray. Is a, is a, this is the ashtray. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you can you can put like uh, uh, ashtray. Yeah, yeah. You, you may also want to put cookies in there, which <laughs> may be something. Um, uh, it's saving aluminum bells, so that does, uh, so that adds some tonality to what I'm playing and and allows me to to come up with some little some little melodic phrases. The cowbells underneath. There are there are four of them. Mm -hmm. One of so it's uh, it's Gone Bob's Alex Acuna cowbells, which is um, which are mostly like, I mean not just for their sound, which is amazing, but they have one feature that I'd like to share with you, mm -hmm. which is uh, this way of mounting them, Whoa. which is very much different from any other mm -hmm. cowbell on the market. Plus, this cowbell never gets loose. It always stays in because place. Because you only have, have a hole, yeah, and, and, and uh, I mean, screw. I mean, that thing here, you, you can open it so much, you could even here, yeah. fix it like on a on a cymbal stand, mm -hmm. and that's something that you can't do with any other. It's the same uh, mountain cowboy. like uh, Tom Holder. Like yeah? on a Tom, mm -hmm. yeah, and uh, it's not just on the Alex Acuna ones; it's also on the on the cheaper ones, mm -hmm. uh, which is just a, a, a pretty unique thing that, that I. Totally dig, mm -hmm. and uh, and so far with the bells and the and the cowbells, the symbols I have here, the the, the crash symbols, are um, HHX explosion crashes. That's 17, 16, 18. Uh, I'm not always using explosion crashes, so most of the time it's extreme crashes or HHX legacies. Mm -hmm. um, but these are also like completely cool. They're a bit thicker as what I usually have, but. Um, that's uh, that's totally all right. With this one here on the left side, yeah. I always have a little splash symbol underneath, which is an AAX a little air surprise. Splash, a little <laughs> surprise, yeah. And uh, especially and having show the sound of having it symbol. underneath it, uh, it cuts a bit different as if it would be like on top of the mm -hmm. symbol. So so I like that sound just much better. Mm -hmm. um, so again, that's 17, 16, 18. Uh, we have um, the 13 inch uh, HHX Fierce hat, uh, which I play many times. At, at times it's also 13 inch Artisan or, or the new HHX um, Click hats, but, but these go with me many times. Yeah. I mean, they are now from the Sabian distribution here in Poland, but... Um, uh, they, they work quite well for, for what I do. Mm -hmm. And uh, the two riot symbols, which are my uh, um, 
my personal signature symbol. So, so this is the garage, right? And uh, I Im imagine that feeling when I when I first read this here, <laughs> uh, which comes uh, in uh, in twenty and. Uh, 20 inch and uh, 18 inch. This is still an old one. That that was one of the prototypes that they made, but it was still in my symbol bag. So, I'm, but but it's it's available like everywhere. And uh, my my other remote head is uh, an XSR uh, head, which is more in a more, more kind of a, a a budget line symbol, but still um, still be 20 bronze. So, great stuff here also. And uh, and an, uh, a seven-inch um, evolution splash uh, HHX that, that I still have here. So far with the symbols, mm -hmm. uh, drum-wise, um, that kit here is um, uh, it, it's all equipped with uh, with Evans drum heads. So it's Evans G2 clear on top of, of the um, of the of the toms. It's um, an Evans uh, Reso 7 coated as a uh, uh, bottom head resonance side, um, which has a little thinner foil, but with the coating adds some more control to the sound, which I like a lot. With the snares, it's um, it's G1 clear, uh, it's it's G1 coated, sorry, mm -hmm. and a hazy 300 underneath, but again all Evans. And with the bass drum, it's um, it's a clear EQ3, EQ4, uh, with that. Extra uh, muffling ring that uh, mm -hmm. that adds a bit more control and a lot of punch. So that's my favorite thing wherever I go. And uh, the drums itself, it's um, it's all Mapex uh, gear. So this is a Saturn V, which is uh, not a super expensive drum kit, but uh, uh, and I, I I play this many times when I when I travel to different countries, but. Uh, Actually, uh, a, a very, a very good set of drums, I should say. Pretty thin shell, maple shell. Inside layer is mm. uh, is one uh, is one layer of walnut. Mm. And uh, what else? I got the, the the Falcon pedals here, which uh, many times travel with me. Um, so I'm I'm like super happy with those. And uh, what else is it that I bring? Mm. I, o I always bring my, my, my short hi-hat rod, of course, uh -huh. because yeah. that would kind of disturb a, a, a bit if, if it were here. And, mm -hmm. and so. Well, for the most part, that's it. Uh, not, not to forget um, yeah. my sticks. sticks so yeah. there's, there's an upcoming signature stick now with, uh, with Promark, um, with my name on, which, uh, which is using... Um, the, the fire grain slash active grip mm -hmm. technology, so I'm super happy with that. It's a bit longer, 16 and a half inch, with a very long taper, which is something that not every stick has, and a, and a much smaller tip than a 5A would usually have. So I have extra reach, I still have power because it's longer than usually, and uh, I have lots of rebound because of that long taper here, and still a lot of, say, durability because, um, because of that fire grain process. Which uh, which just adds extra strength to the to the wood, and um, I think that's that's sort of the yeah. the little walk through through the starship here. <laughs> Thank you. <very laughs> much. One more thing, yeah. this yeah. thing on eighty inch. Ah yeah. Oh yeah, I, I, I almost had forgot. That that's that's also something that travels with me quite a lot, which uh, which I use. I mean, it's it's somewhat between a rivet-like sound, but uh, uh, and, and somewhat between rivets and and a stack mm -hmm. sound. So so it has these these metal plates, which uh, which are actually uh, the, the the plates that get uh, that get cut out when they uh, when Sabian makes the ozone crashes. I see. Yeah. So these are actually leftovers from the <laughs> from the. 25th anniversary that, that Sabian was having, <laughs> and I organized quite some of them, uh, and, and and made my own little devices here. And uh, I mean, I have them, and, and Carl Brazil once saw it, so so he also has, <laughs> has one of it. Uh, I'm not not even sure if, if he still uses it, but but uh, he he desperately wanted to have one, so, mm. so I, I should ask Carl if <laughs> if he still has it somewhere <laughs> in his bag. So yeah, that, that's some some quite interesting yeah. addition. Thank you. <laughs>